Hey guys, what's up? It's both your one Nola, and today I'm gonna to be answering our Q&A questions. Now, I've only got like four questions here, so do work with me. <laughs> this is gonna be a pretty short video, which is fine because you know I just wanted to do a QA. and a It's been like a long time since we've done one, and I needed something to upload today because I didn't really have anything planned. Um, I am going to upload some Yamarari Night Alone gameplay tomorrow. I will try and finish uploading that series. It's been like a few weeks now since I played that game and I still have the footage for it. Sadly, I can't upload Life is Strange footage just because um, the final episode got lost somehow. So I don't want to upload like an incomplete series. That would just pretty much suck at that point. But with all that out of the way, let's get into the questions. Uh, the first question comes from Derek, who's been with me on YouTube for like a long ass time now. His question is, I wonder if you have played or would try out Lineage 2 Revolution at any point. Um, well, pretty much any MMORPG game on mobile is kind of a gray area for me just because I can't really get into them. I mean, if it was like a one-time play, maybe. I'll... I'll probably do a once I play video on it, but normally I can't get behind like mobile RP MMO RPGs because they're like, and eh, it's just like I, I I can't explain it. Like if anything, I can get behind PC MMO RPGs really easily. Fine, it mobiles is just that uh, just not a huge fan of them. That's. That's pretty much it. But maybe I'll do like a first impression video on it. Uh, that's not out of the question. All right, our next questions, well, three questions come from Death. And his first question is, so now that you have gotten to where you are, how are you feeling about your channel? Hmm. How am I feeling about my channel? <laughs> eh. <laughs> I'm just pretty much uploading what I feel like uploading and just chilling. <laughs> I mean, at this point, I just stopped caring about views, likes, or dislikes. It's, I just started going passive when it comes to that stuff. It's just like, I feel no emotions when it comes to it. The only thing that makes me feel happy at this point is just when people comment and want to talk to me and stuff. That's pretty much it. That's the only thing I feel towards. Um, as of where my channel is right now, I'm... I'm kind of fine with it. Other people might not be fine with that, but that's all right. That's why I have Twitch for, so we can play other games instead of just, you know, uploading mobile games, first impressions and all that. But that's just pretty much our placement. And not many people know that I stream on Twitch now. Some of them have uh, probably been waiting for me to come back to YouTube streaming, which I don't want to do anymore because YouTube is a huge gray area. <laughs> Just because YouTube is really annoying with half of their, like, crap they have going on. So I try and avoid streaming on YouTube anymore and just go with Twitch. So streaming on Twitch is pretty much like my second backup. Just just in case something happens to me on YouTube, I can still stream on Twitch. And just in case something happened to me on Twitch, I still have YouTube. If something happened to me on both, then I'm kind of shit out of luck there. <laughs> Uh, his second question is, do you have any more ideas for starting up a long series like Dragon Blaze or the Alchemist Code? Um, well, that hasn't really been many games that I felt like doing actual series on. Um, you guys know I had um, Twin Saga for a while and Dragomon, but Dragomon got shut down. Twin Saga hit a huge writing phase for me. They fixed it, but I just don't know if I want to get back into it. Um, I'm trying to figure out a series that will actually catch my eye and I've already gotten like Twitch series is which is pretty much well not Twitch series my it's the main Twitch games let's say um, Knights Chronicle is one of them you guys already know that um, Sudorica is another one now just because that game is actually pretty fun um, I have no other main games on my Twitch channel at the moment because we pretty much just go in and out of games but those are the two main games on my channel and I just pretty much stream Dragon Blaze Guild Adventures on Saturdays and that's it so I I've mostly been converting those series that could be on a channel over to Twitch 
you know. <laughs> but I can think about it because we have a few series that we have dropped and it's kind of been like really getting to me if I actually wanted to start it up again, uh, which is Pirates Online. Pirates Online got into a state where, you know, I wanted to wait for it to get, you know, a little bit more into the updates, get some of the bugs out, you know, flesh some stuff out. Uh, so that series is on hold for a while. Other series I am still currently thinking about. I want to try and get series that I can get, you know, a lot of people into. And there aren't really many PC, like, MMOs I can get everybody into. Well, Maple Story 2 is coming up sooner or later, so I'm going to see if I can get others into that and, you know, have fun with that. Because it actually looks pretty interesting from what I've seen. Uh, I haven't really seen any, like, action gameplay on it yet, though. I've mostly just seen, like, dancing, competitions, and stuff like that, and that's pretty much it. And I haven't even gotten to the closed betas, man. Feels bad. Feels real bad. But, yeah, I'm still searching for a few series just to, you know, replace some or you know, put on certain days like I do with um, Dragon Blaze and the Alchemist Code, which Alchemist Code is on Thursdays and Dragon Blaze is on Tuesdays. So yeah, I'm still trying to figure out that whole situation of uh, adding more series on. Just haven't gotten any that actually feels right for me to do a series on, you know? And his third and final question is also, do you have any plans to join into more MMOs? Um... Not sure, because there aren't many MMOs that really keep my interest. Bless Online was going to kind of get me into it, but it, it, it kind of flopped really hard. And I was like, you know what? I'm just going to save my money on this situation. There's no point in trying to buy into this game. And after all the negative reviews and all the shit they got, I was just like, yeah, I, I dodged a bullet here. <laughs> But if Bless Online goes free to play, then I'll be like, yeah, I'm down. But there are, like I said, there aren't many games that I can get myself into. I haven't been inside the long grinding phase in like a long time now. If there was a few that I would probably get back into, it would probably be Grand Fantasia or Eden Eternal. You know, stuff like that. Not fully sure yet. It's going to take me some time to... You know, find <laughs> find that right game for me, because you guys know I played a lot of MMOs like um, Revelation Online and what was the other one? Blade and Soul, and I couldn't get behind those because those were like, eh. Blade and Soul just got into like a real good pay to win for the PvP, and I was just like, yeah, no, I'm good. Even though I don't really PvP, but it's just mm, mm, huge gray area. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much all the questions I have for today. Oh, so if I do do another Q&A, make sure to, you know, ask me some questions. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much all the questions I got for this Q&A. Um, if you guys have any questions that you didn't get to ask, put them down in the comments and maybe it'll, you know, hit you up with a reply and give you your answer. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it. Have a good rest of the day. I gotta go get ready to stream tonight. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. Peace out.